I don't feel like I really, it, ne it never really hit me like at one moment. It was kind of just like slowly creeping in on me. But the first like couple of months, I didn't really feel different. Like I went back to school a week after it happened. Um, and then I started therapy um, maybe two months later. And then I really started talking about it. And that's when I kind of realized like, yeah, everything is different. Like I used to remember when I came back to school, um, anytime I got a text, I was like, oh, is that my mom texting me? And then I was like, oh, just kidding. That's not gonna happen. Um, so it was just kind of like slowly things changed and holiday, like the first Christmas was very weird. And um, with my family, like my sister and I are very close, but we never really talk about how we're feeling about my mom. And with my grandma, anytime we brought my mom up, she would start crying. And so we never really wanted to bring it up because we didn't want to all start crying. Um, so it's, it was weird because my family was never very open about talking about it. So at least I had therapy to kind of talk it out. And I did group therapy with other um, people at Ryerson who lost their parent, one of their parents. But I never, um, in, during those groups, like there was never a girl who lost her mom. There were, um, you know, girls who lost their dads or like boys who lost their moms, but there wasn't any girl who lost her mom. And I feel like that bond is so special and like so different that uh, I never really had someone to connect to with how I was feeling about that. Uh, so that was kind of tough. And now I've actually met a couple of people who have like women who have lost their moms and we connect like so well, like everything that we say, we're like, yes, <laughs> I get it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a very special bond that we lost. And um, it's extremely hard just because I was really close with my mom and my sister was really close with my mom. So um, we really had to kind of become strong, independent people at a really young age. Like I was 17 and my sister was 13, so it was 